If people like you, they'll listen to you. But if they trust you, they'll do business with you. This is Your Business Needs a Podcast. I'm your host, Jay Lee, and the founder of Provision Podcasts. This is the show where I try to convince you in five minutes or less how podcasting can help you grow your business and have a little bit more fun. And so if you're ready, let's get into it. All right, welcome to Your Business Needs a Podcast. And the quote that I read in the cold open is from the famous sales guru, Zig Ziglar. And what he said is, if people like you, they'll listen to you. But if they trust you, then they'll do business with you. And so trust is a critical ingredient in sales and business, which brings us to reason number two why your business needs a podcast is because people trust podcasters. Now, how do we know this? Well, here's a few statistics for you. Now, this comes from Deloitte Digital Media Trends, which was published in April of 2023. And they found that over 75% of people indicated that they trust the podcast hosts they listen to. And that was across all generations. So Gen Z, Millennials, Gen X, 75% indicated they trust the podcast hosts they listen to. And also in that same study, they found that over 38% of people indicated that they were influenced by ads that they heard listening to podcasts more so than ads that they hear in other places. A couple more statistics. These are from ACAST Research. And in one of their studies, they found that 95% of frequent podcast listeners have actually taken action after hearing an advertisement on a podcast, 95%. And they also found in a study that they did in conjunction with Nielsen in the UK is that 80% of people trust recommendations that they get from podcast hosts that they're currently listening to. 80% trust the recommendations they get from podcast hosts. And what's really interesting about that is that's almost as high is how much people trust recommendations from family, which was at 85%, and also recommendations they get from friends, 84%. And so I think the picture that we get here is that people really trust podcast hosts that they listen to, probably because just the nature of podcasts, it's, it's much more personal, much more relational than other forms of media, right? And so I think when we listen to a podcast, we we feel like we have a connection and we know the podcaster. And because of that, people tend to trust the recommendations that they get from these podcasters. And so advertisers on podcasts, they get what is called sort of a halo effect that by virtue of the trust that listeners have in their podcast hosts, advertisers are sort of getting some runoff trust just by advertising on those shows. And in fact, just one last statistic. This is from a 2019 podcast trends report by Discover Pods, but they found that 55% of podcast fans had actually purchased something advertised to them on a podcast. And so how can our businesses benefit from having our own podcasts? Well, if people who advertise on podcasts are getting so much benefit from the trust that listeners have in their podcast hosts, then how much more so if you're not just advertising on a podcast, but you actually are the host and you're the one who listeners are forming a relationship with and connecting with and beginning to trust, not just as a faceless business out there somewhere, but as somebody who they go to for recommendations and somebody whose recommendations they actually trust, maybe almost as much as their own family and friends. And so your business needs a podcast because people trust podcasters. So go start that podcast. Your business needs a podcast is a provision podcast production. If you enjoyed this episode, give us a follow, leave us a review or share this episode with a colleague. And reach out to us if you're ready to look into starting your own podcast. You can find all of our links in the episode description. 